so we have the topic, uh, what is racism, how did it start, and when did it start? Uh, my name is Mikhail. I'm Mikhail. I'm Anthony. My name is Quinn. <laughs> Alright, so we just um, made a few questions and asked to VSU, and we had a lot of uh, different nationalities. We had Korean, African American, actual African, um, Caucasian, um, but we had a lot of questions here for our group to answer. Um, what is your nationality? Well, for me, I'm Irish, African, Native American, and Cuban. Alright, All right. Um, see, Anthony, have you ever encountered racism before? Uh, yes, I have. I definitely have. Um, well, the first time I've ever experienced it was in middle school when my teacher just, I had a watch on and my teacher assumed that I had stole it, but my friend knew it was mine and he said that wasn't right. And he was actually Caucasian. And so he actually went with me to the principal and told it and told and said she was being like very, very, like she was like, like she definitely was going pretty far. And yeah, that was my first time experiencing. So she just pretty much. She was being racist against you stealing pretty much. Yeah, she, she assumed I had stole it, but it was actually a gift. Gotcha. Gotcha. Right. Gotcha. All right. So what's your nationality? Um, I'm black as far as I know. I don't black as far as you know, because you're pretty light skin. Um, <laughs> <laughs> have you ever experienced racism at VSU? At VSU, uh, no. I would say not yet. What is racism? Racism. Racism. Yeah, racism. Okay. <laughs> racism, uh, to me, I think it is like being a split, the distinguished between the groups of, you know, ethnicities, one being more one being some more superior than the other, you know, other one being inferior, blacks over whites, whites over blacks, sorry, Caucasians or Hispanics, doesn't matter. Just one being greater than the other in certain like characteristics. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, I agree with that. What is racism? I believe it is like a prejudgment before you actually know somebody just based on color. Um, I think it's like stereotypical more than like race because I feel like race is a part of the history and we're just like repeating it but it's more of like a black or white issue um I had a sit down conversation with my grandmother and she asked me she said Mikhail can you see yourself dating or marrying a black guy and like it it was kind of just <laughs> like what kind of question is that like her generation growing up was nothing like ours is today. You know, love is love pretty much. But she said, or she stated that in the Bible, black and whites are not supposed to marry. And I just thought that was absolutely absurd. So I actually looked it up and um, in Galatians 3.28, it says, there's neither Jew nor Greek. There's neither slave nor free. There is no male and female, for you are all one in Christ Jesus. And I just believe, like, that is one, like, a one love, one tradition. You know, it doesn't matter what color you are, but that's how I feel about it. Well, for me, racism is basically when someone of the same race or someone of a different race commits little actions that kind of, like, get to you. Race started. Back to you. Okay, I think race started in York since they were uh, focusing on the Bible during that time, back in the day. And they wanted to put people of color uh, in positions in the Bible to get them basically doing what they want just for religious purposes, even though it was kind of wrong. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Uh... And a lot of people think that racism started with the African slave trade. like. You know, there were people even before then, like the Greeks and Romans, like you said, with the Roman law and the barbarians being slaves. But that was a long time ago. Mm -hmm. When do you guys think it started? When did it start? Maybe like 15, 1600. Well, oh, think before then. Yeah, before yeah. then? I think before. BC? BC and all that. <laughs> yeah. I think. Uh, them cavemen. The cavemen? <laughs> the cavemen. We don't really know. Yeah, uh, no, it's, no, it's been a long time. Um, There's no defined answer to that. Honestly, 
I believe there's no exact answer, but I do believe that when it if we could trace it back, I'd say it'd be around the time when the Europeans were trying to um, take over, you know, and colonize, you know, came over to North America. Capitalism. Yeah, but... Uh, I also think it's like part of our human nature, so I don't really think it's like defined as a race as to when it started, but I think it's in our human nature to prejudge people based on color. Yeah, I can see that. I can feel like back then everybody was just with everybody who looked like them. Like, yeah. if you weren't white, and you were not normal, you weren't black or light skin or whatever shade of color you were, you you were misplaced with the group. You need to go with your group. And I think that's how it all started and kind of shape shifted and got worse from then on out through history. So, yeah, because I it definitely still goes on today, honestly. Yeah, like it. Ha I do believe it has. It's not what it used to be. You know, I believe you know. But, it's worse in like certain countries yeah. yeah it's it's worse in certain countries i mean other countries have their own racial issues as well and i definitely think um it was worse off like in the past where our grandparents were hey it's good how you doing today good how are you what's your name maya uh, my name's quinn i'm gonna ask you a question um okay how did race start what's your opinion about that Wow, that's a very deep question. How did race start? Um, I don't want to say that I don't know, but race is such a broad topic, and I think that can start with someone's personal opinion when someone tries to categorize uh, specific individuals. And, you know, sometimes it's not, it's not good to do that. So, another question? Uh, where do you think race started? I think, again, uh, I think people's opinion, people's own mind, people formulate their own, their own thoughts and is it good and a bad tier to go for the both sides? So. Just, just guess. Just yeah. guess a place. Um, place, country, state. What do you think of America. 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 You think it started over here in the U.S.? In the U.S. I think that's probably. Hey, how are you doing? I'm doing good. Mikkel? I'm CJ. Nice to meet you. Is it okay if I ask you a question? That's okay. All right. How do you think? I'm African. So I've always been the superior race in my country. There's not, we've not, I've, I didn't grow up in an environment whether it's white or black. So I believe my opinions on, about race will be very biased considering the fact that I'm more prone to, to support the black race. But basically based on what I've seen in the country and how I feel about what has been going on, I would say racism is, racism is actually real. It is real. There are white supremacy and the whole, issue is actually a very depressing issue in this country and even if I do support the black race I would say that it's it's kind of the fact that they have to do the black people on their own part still have to do something about a change I mean they they depend on the white people for a change for the white people to change first but I do believe that if you don't change yourself first other people wouldn't change for you right so do you still think there's race today? Well, I still... Even if it's like black and white, do you think that? I, I personally do not see color. Like I said, I, I grew up in a country where I was the only superior race. Okay. So, I do not see color, but I do believe that yes, actually racism still does exist in our time today. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> illegal immigrants, and whenever people think of illegal immigrants, they mainly push it towards the Hispanics, yeah. whether it be not even from Mexico, they'll go to South America saying they're Mexicans, but they're not. They're South American. Yeah. 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 What is your um, nationality? So I came from the South Korea. Okay. And yeah, South Korea and Jesus Island. And this is my people. Yeah. Is race an issue here from you living there? Yeah, even so it's kind of international, like uh, airport in there. So, so there's so many like Chinese, even even the same Asian. They're like, I came from. Uh, they're living in Korea, but there's a lot of Chinese, Japanese, and sometimes there's a uh, like Australian. 